Hello, this is Nurse Tilson here. In this little video, I'd like to show you how to set up a rather specific, particular configuration of drawers. Here we have a little cabinet where we have um, two drawers, but the second drawer, the upper drawer here, is actually hiding behind the lower drawer facade. So we can see that, in actual fact, we have two drawers, but the front, the bottom drawer facade is extended over the upper drawer, and the upper drawer is just fits behind the lower drawer facade. So how do we set this up? So we're starting here with a simple box and if we're looking 3D we just have this simple box in beach and in this box we want to put two drawers and one above the other but with the bottom drawers facade being used for both drawers. So you have to open the bottom drawer first and then you get access to the inside drawer. Okay let's start off by slit sitting in a separation. Let's add a shelf and let's just say for this shelf is going to divide our volume up into two volumes so that we put a shelf in the bottom and a shelf at the top so we can put this particular shelf where we want it let's just put it in the middle for the time being the first thing we do let's put in the top door drawer let's click here and add a drawer in this volume and let's in the assembly details let's put everything to make the drawer ourselves all the insides of the drawer and let's just put it in place and here we have our upper drawer which is in place if we open it we can see this is our upper drawer and let's uh, get rid of the facade because we don't really want this facade since the facade we're going to be using for the upper drawer is the same facade as it is for the lower drawer so we're going to select the facade click into the materials and instead of using and a, 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 a real material let's use a nil panel so it in fact disappears and we only have on the upper side the upper drawer with its insides. Now, how do we put the lower drawer in? Let's go into the uh, cabinet edit mode and let's click twice in this volume here. Clicking twice in this volume I will select first the lower volume and then I will select the, the upper volume. Now we have both volumes selected by clicking twice. Click right and click add drawers. And let's the same thing again. Let's put in our different assembly details for the inside of our drawer and click OK and let's add this drawer and now if we have a look in 3D we can see that Polyboard has actually built a, a drawer with its facade covering the whole both both volumes here if we open it up we can see that we've got a lower drawer which has been calculated in the lower volume divided by this shelf yeah? and the upper facade extends in fact over the whole box what we still have here is the shelf. We don't want the shelf. We go into here, we go into select the shelf here and take the material as a nil panel, put it its, its uh, material nil panel and the shelf will actually disappear. We've got no more shelf here. The sizes of the re drawers are recalculated and we still have our, our neat configuration here of the lower drawer with its facade covering the upper drawer so that we have to have, ac have access to the upper drawer we open the lower drawer and then we can pull out the upper, the, the upper drawer so that's how you do it that's quite easy and simple and I hope that's been interesting for you and if you have that to do you know how to do it now thanks for looking goodbye